everybody. Today, the book I'm going to be reading is called Where's the Green Sheep? by Mem Fox and Judy Horacek. Now, take a look at the sheep. They don't really look like sheep that could really live on the farm. I see a purple sheep and a blue sheep, yellow sheep, orange sheep, red sheep. And there's all different kinds of sheep in this book, but we're looking for the green sheep. So we're going to read Where's the Green Sheep, published by Harcourt. Here is the blue sheep. And here is the red sheep. Here is the bath sheep. And here oh, is the bed sheep. But where is the green sheep? Here is the thin sheep, and here is the wide sheep. Here is the swing sheep, and here is the slide sheep. But where is the green sheep? Here is the up sheep, here is the down sheep. Here is the band sheep. Here is the clown sheep. But where is the green sheep? Here is the sun sheep. And here is the rain sheep. Here is the car sheep. And here is the train sheep. But where is the green sheep? Here is the wind sheep. Here is the wave sheep. Here's the scared sheep, and here's the brave sheep. But where's the green sheep? Here's the near sheep. Here's the far sheep. Here's the moon sheep, and here is the star sheep. But where's the green sheep? Oh, look at all those different sheep. Do you see a green one anywhere? I don't know. Where is that green sheep? Turn the page quietly. Let's take a peek. Here's our green sheep. Fast asleep. So look, all the way back in the beginning, the green sheep was hiding behind the bush. I don't know if the green sheep was hiding or if the green sheep just needed a nap or if the green sheep was camouflaging because he's green and the bush is green too. But I liked looking at all the other sheep and seeing what they were doing. The story reminds me a little bit of Go Dog Go because that book has lots of dogs doing different things. And this book has lots of sheep doing different things, things that they could not do in real life. So I hope you liked Where is the Green Sheep? I'll see you next time. Bye.